Ah, people. Show no mercy. You're witnessing a biblical piece of work here by the beast known as Sandy Ravage. Yeah, you'll notice Sandy Ravage is equipped with a sparse shotgun or whatever the hell it is. It's a straight up beast gun. Then some little bitch tries to get a clean shot on Sandy. But being an athletic beast, it's not gonna happen. Look at that straight up beast right there. Come again, son! Look at that straight up beast hanging out the window. These boys ain't know what hit him. As a matter of fact, this man took on nine guys by himself, basically. A one man army here. They should make a patch for Sandy Ravage in this game. Because he's an unstoppable force. Look at this shit! Look at this shit! I mean, serious, Predator the missile right off the bat. And then some little bitch comes around the corner and gets a lucky shot on him. Now, Sandy Ravage sensed that these boys are gonna quit. So he missed on purpose with that Predator missile. He knew that these soldiers were ill equipped to deal with a man of his caliber. And then that guy gets him up there. That's alright, make it count. Cause you ain't gonna get too many more of them. You better make it count. So look at that dumbass trying to shoot at him. So what's he do? He takes the back door. And he sees a little bitch trying to cower in the corner. And he blasts his ass. And they're always on the move. Look at this shit. Look at this. Boom! Boom! And notice how fast he moves. With a cat. Look at that cat. Look at that. Look at that cat camping over. That's alright. Make it count, son. You ain't gonna get many more of them. You ain't gonna get many more of them. You come around the corner, right where he got killed, he's gonna look for him again. And then some little bitch gets him again. Now, you got the beast mad now. Sandy Ravage is visibly upset. And he's gonna take it out on these ill-equipped soldiers. He comes around, he gets stuck on that Volvo, but that ain't gonna stop his boss now, is it? Hell no. It ain't gonna stop his ass, he's a beast. Then he sees this dumbass trying to drink a cup of coffee. And he makes it his last one, because that's... What he does. Look at this dumbass here. Boom! Double kill! This man is a straight up beast. Like I said. And then this guy gets a lucky shot off. Like I said, you better make it You better make it count, son. You better make it count. Because I'm gonna tell you right now. If it ain't gonna count, you're gonna be done. Look at that. He parlays this grenade throw over there. Goes up the steps. Son, get out the way. That's Sandy Ravage you're standing in front of. Then he jumps over, kills that bastard, and then this bastard gets a lucky shot on him. That's bullshit. That's all right, though. Make it count. I'll take five deaths against 40 kills all the time. And that's what the beast does. He's just straight up beast in this game. Someone throws a grenade. What's he do? Look at the quick like cat like reflexes. Quick legs. Boom! Boom! Double kill my ass. That's a triple kill. Get it right, game. I ain't gonna look at this dumbass with his back turn. Back turn and that spot get done. And then this dumbass so scared he shits his pants and kills himself. Look at that dumbass, runs into his own Claymore, or Gaymore. Look at the Predator missile. Straight up beasting being done here. Straight up Spostin. These motherfuckers ain't know what hit him. Matter of fact, the same endless life. Look at this shit, straight up hair strike now. He's straight up beasting. And look at this cat like reflex. That's time to deploy a Harrier or a precision. Look at this shit. Son, you ain't getting cover here. You ain't getting cover here. Ain't gonna happen. <clears throat> So now it's gonna do a goddamn precision airstrike and double kill. Notice I say that a lot because it just keeps happening. So he gets the KC-130, he ain't even gonna use it yet. You know why? He wants to find more people to kill. Look at that shit. A thing of beauty, people. So now, Sandy Rabbit's gonna deploy the KC-130 and take a break for a while. Now you'll notice I say this numerous times. Double kill. Triple kill. Double kill! Triple kill! You might as well just keep repeating it, because that's what keeps happening. These other good soldiers are terrified, petrified, horrified, humidified, and Sammy Ravage is glorified. It. He's just straight up beasting them. I mean, say, I wish I could play this way, but unfortunately, I don't have a tenth of a sixteenth of these. Because the triple kill again, it's a thing of beauty. Like I said, they need to make a patch for this man. Because, man, seriously, how the fuck can you combat the uncombatable? You can't do it. Matter of fact, people in the lobbies ought to just quit the game. Admit defeat. Save their lives. Save them while they can. Look at this dumbass. Man, son, you better come strong. Boom. You're done. You're done. How many more lives does he have to end? Just give up. Wave the white flag. Now... Look, he look, he just look, he sees a guy over there, but you know what he knows where they're at. He's gonna go, you're done! 
He just knows what he's doing. This, this guy is a straight up beast. I love watching. Look at that. Son, son. You better run quicker. Then you're going to run into a spot. I mean, how many more do you have to kill? S save your own life. Look at this shit. Another double kill. Save your own life. The Marty Dom ain't going to work. So then he has to reload, but you know what? He says, you know what, man? Fuck it. I need one more kill to end this travesty. He traumatized this team. You know what he says? I ain't going to reload. I'm going to traumatize with one bullet. And what's he do? He jumps out the window and must have ate his weenies because he ends the game. On a standing, leaving jump in midair. It ends the game. That's the thing of beauty, people. Look at that. He beats the fight so bad that the connection got interrupted. Look at that shit. That guy was saved by the shitty ass Infinity Ward servers. That's the only reason that guy was saved. That is straight up beast to find people. And I want to thank Sandy Ravitch for giving this opportunity to commentate on this biblical piece of work.